Hello everyone, my name is Nerd Computer Man, and welcome back to The Walking Dead Michonne. Last we left off, we beat episode 2, Give No Shelter. Now, we are going on to the final episode of this mini-series, What We Deserve. Very excited to see what's going to happen in this last part of this. Kind of sad that it's only three parts because I kind of wanted the whole five, because why not? So let's get right into it. We all remember the backstory that previously on. <gasps> Randall should be the one laying there, not your brother. I'm not leaving you behind. You start butchering their people, and our chances of making it out of here, any of us, go down to zero. Very true. They, they had some supplies just sitting out and, and Norma caught me. I didn't think she was going to, but she, she, she let me go. And here we go. Back with the hallucinations and whatnot. Ooh! Actually, if you guys remember, last episode we were stuck with Randall and we decided not to kill him we th we like remember we said that he could be a valuable piece in bargaining but we never know yeah right here see we let him live yes that means the dance is over maybe he'll die I oh, know we kept tightening that clamp that was very brutal of us your funeral All right, so now we get to play episode three. Very excited. Just letting you guys know. Oh, what's this? Oh, dead children. Why the time jump on the on the last episode? She was only with them for three I'm weeks, not though. Thinking about jumping. So this is a week you in. Do, I'm gonna have to come in after you. I'm not looking forward to that. Water's gonna be an ice uh, I just needed some space. Uh, you're gonna need a bigger boat. Ooh, freezing my ass off. Yeah. Coffee will warm you up. Go on. Yeah, I'll take a sip. Why not? <laughs> God damn, Oak. You can't call it coffee when more than half's whiskey. Uh, you sound like my ex wife. She was more of a rum girl. Should have denied it, but hey, we got a drink. They really ran out of jokes on in the apocalypse, didn't they? Because that was terrible. It was awful. Really, it was. I despised a lot of them when I first got on board. But they grow on you. I mean, like I guess. Mole, they are. Nah, nah, sorry. That shit, isn't it? They're growing on me, too. Kind of nice that people can still joke around. It's a fine line between the court jester and the village idiot. Ah, which is yeah, him, which side I think he's on. Before I joined up with Pete, my brother and I were cooped up in an old canning factory. Food for ages. A lot of fat and happy people. Then but then There we go. A young girl got taken. We followed a trail. It wasn't hard. Blood. Oh, God. Ended up cornering the people who took her in this 
warehouse. All ten of us went in. Only I came out. How? What'd you do? You did the right thing. And he got my brother killed. Oh! I right think and kiss my ass. Yeah, that seems about Two right. later I came across Pete. Ways up the coast. And he saw that look on my face and he offered me a job. But how did he survive though? That's what I want to know. And turn me away. Just welcomed me in. Pete's a good goddamn egg in a rotten world. I don't always get Pete, but I'm glad people like him still exist. He still shouldn't trust people oh, like that. I saw that other option, but. Yeah. But I wanna know how he survived. Well, uh, what, like ten other people? Is winding down so we can finally play cards. Care to join us? It'd be nice to have you there. Yeah, yeah I'll play some cards. Why not? Do me in. Do me in. Like a challenge. You might regret it when I win that machete of yours. Uh, you're not getting your hands on my machete. I didn't know we were this friendly with Oak. I thought it was sort of like a neutral relationship. But I guess not so much. I guess we were bonding. I guess now. Yeah. Oh, back to present day. Hit him. Well, hey there, Michelle. Sam, I knew you couldn't stay away. Don't fucking talk to me. Oh, God. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Easy, all right? Jesus. A little help here. Please, I need a hand. Nah, we gotta, we gotta chill a little bit. Let go of me. Thank you. Why did you stop me? Yeah, but... Why are you protecting him? We can trade him for our safety. But not if he's beaten any worse than he is. Safety? <laughs> oh, he's beaten pretty bad, though. That's the thing. That ship has sailed and sunk, ladies. <coughs> What's funny here is you think me and my sister are the bad ones. But you're the one who burned down our home. Forced our people on the shore to be easy pickings for the walkers. Families. Kids never did shit to you. Didn't stop to think about all the lives you were screwing up, all the shit they had to leave behind. I'm not hitting him. That was an accident. Tell that to the parents who lost their kids. How about you it's shut up? Piss you off. Obviously. You're done talking. You're the one who should be dead. Sam, calm down. My dad isn't even in the fucking ground yet, and you want me to calm down? I I didn't. True. Believe you ruined everything he killed your brother your dad soon you no I know you don't know wait you hear that loud and clear and it's really eerie now Michonne you don't want to keep me waiting what do you want? Oh, you're gonna wanna hear this. You might be sitting pretty thinking you have the upper hand, but your luck has changed. Michelle and Sadiq. They got the rest of the crew, too. Oh, crap. Whatever this bitch asks, don't. Sadiq! Oh, no. Don't worry. They're all in good hands here. But them staying that way is up to you. So listen closely. I'm willing to trade my brother for your friend. But anything you do to Randall, I will do to them. Do you understand? Uh, oh, God, that's too much. Nope, we can't do anything to Randall. But then we already did. We already broke his hands and broke his nose and gave him like... You don't owe me oh. anything, but please, we have to get them back. That goes both ways. Anything you do to my friends, I'll do to Randall. You better not touch him! Or what? What are you gonna do? Huh? We'll Nothing. be there by sunrise. Be ready for us. Shit. Sunrise, how long is that? I don't know the time period in this in the in the freaking game. 
<laughs> oh. So, what do you think's gonna happen next? <laughs> Can I be the one to kill him? It's all I want. Just gonna get my machete out. Just hit him a couple times. There we go, it's the intro one more time. And the last time. Unless they make a Walking Dead Michonne 2. Then that would be a lot better. That'd be pretty awesome if they did that. Because I would... I'd watch that. Not watch it, I'd play that. I'd play it for you guys. But it'll probably be a while until they have that. There's a lot of Telltale games that are coming out this year. That I'm interested. Actually, not a lot. I just say that. But there's one in particular that I'm very interested in playing this year. And you may or may not know by now, but Telltale is coming out with a Batman game. Yeah. Five-part series and everything. Just like that. So, you know, that'll be cool. I can't wait for that. something on my face. Shut up! The bruises aren't so bad. Right? You better clean them up. I'm pretty sure she'll notice the fingers. Shut up! Maybe it won't matter. That bag will help cover his injuries. Some of them at least. She's gonna want to see his face. Maybe we can stall her. And then what? The minute you hand him over, she's gonna take that bag off his head. What then? <laughs> yeah, I'd say we're pretty screwed, but that's just a personal you opinion. I have no idea what you're in for. <sighs> He's right. Norma's not gonna leave us alone. She won't stop just because we gave her her brother back. Sure, you kept him alive, but we still burned all their shit. So we run. After you trade for your friends, we haul ass to the back gate and get the hell out of here. But she'd take the house. Let her have it. Wouldn't she expect us to run? So what? She knows where we are now. Hiding isn't an option. Yeah, I don't know exactly where we would go. That's not the best... I don't know. The best thing. Does it matter? Anywhere would be better than here. I can't fucking listen to this. What? <laughs> Sam, where are you going? What the heck, man? I'll watch you. Sam! Yeah, she's gonna bury your dad. Stop. You're gonna hurt yourself. There it is. God damn it. That wound's gonna reopen. Sam, stop. Maybe you're all ready to walk away, but I'm not just gonna leave him like this. <laughs> Sam's gonna die. I feel it. I my mom a real funeral. My dad and I. Had to bury her here. Just the two of us. He'd want to be with her. That's all I can give him. I understand. I, yeah, but 
He should be buried with your mom. Yeah, but this is too right now. soon. You have to be ready to leave. I'm not going. What? Sam, you can't still be thinking. My mom is here, Paige. Everything I have of her. And Greg, if you want to leave, go ahead, but I'm not coming with you. Oh, God. I'm sorry. But I, I can't go. That's okay. This house meant everything to my dad. It's all I have left. I know you don't want to, but leaving might be your only option. It isn't safe here anymore. I know, but I, I can't just give up. We can fight. We can defend this house. With the normal, I, I'm not sure. They have guns and like no matter what happens, actual weapons. Thank you. I owe you my life. Sorry it took me so long to say it. You're welcome. So he was shot in the head, so he's not coming back as a walker, thankfully. I have to help a little bit, okay? I know it's stupid, but I have to finish this. I've got some weapons stashed in my room. Old duffel bag. Should look familiar. Ah. Just make sure everyone's armed before Norma gets here. Yeah. See, the stuff we got involved with. Oh my god. God, there's dirt more often now. And anything's just making us trip at this point. Hey. <laughs> I, I was just wanted to know what it felt like. I, I wasn't going to shoot it. Careful. You don't want to shoot yourself. So you're just going to leave him with the gun? Empty. Uh, what about the one he has? Can I help? I want to do something. Sure, go ahead. I'll let the boy help, but... Round side four. Die like that, Greg and Dad. What do you mean? I, I thought we were safe here. No. What am I supposed to do? You have to be smart. That's how you survive. My dad was the smartest guy I knew. I'm not gonna try to scare this that kid. Didn't save him. Because we might need him. The guy who did it killed my dad. He's got to, I mean, the things he said, the way he was laughing about Dad. We have to give Randall back to his sister, James. I heard you guys talking. There's more people coming to the house. Sam's hurt. If, if she, they can't hurt her too. Your sister's tough. Yeah, she really is. She's been through a lot in these past couple, like, hours. I, I don't know if I'm ready. You know, to have one. Hang on to this. You don't know when you might need it. I'm no not sure. Here. Things could go wrong. He anyway. might save us. That's the I'll thing. Be careful. Giving him this gun might have been one of the best options because this might go into the future further on. We might need him. I don't know. I'm telling you more often, he's going to get us in trouble. No, oh my god. 
All right, so we need to hand out the guns to everyone in the household so we can protect every single buddy, every single one in the household. All right, so we need to... Oh, God. you Can you hear the children? Because I hear the children. That's something I don't want to deal with. No more see right through this. Shut up, Randall. <laughs> they give us an option to punch him. Uh, yeah, let's give him the gun. Thanks. Yeah, I don't... Keep ignoring me. Yes. Oh, Paige is upstairs? Alright. Whoa, picture! Do you see the picture? No. <laughs> I noticed that. It's happening more and more. This is bad. This is really bad. This isn't good because these if these keep happening like the way they are, and I'm pretty sure there's about to be one right here, it, it could go bad for us. It could happen while we're fighting Norma and it'll be like, I don't know, like something weird like our daughter goes in front of her and then we can't shoot Norma and then Norma shoots us and then we're dead. That's what happens in the Walking Dead world. Is that? It's crazy, but it's true. Music? Tripping. Ah, oh, come on! This happens way too often. What is this running? Ooh, the never ending hallway. And she's on the ground. These these trips need to like chill out. Can I come in? What's happening? Oh, okay, so the, he was playing the music. We weren't actually imagining that, but still, it was pretty trippy. I like that. It's pretty. My dad gave Ooh. it to me, so oh. I wouldn't have to hear the things out there. Your dad was nice. Stay in my fortress, I'm safe. You called that a fortress? I bad stuff out. I put pillows and blankets against the wall. Looks pretty sturdy. I bet it's kept you nice and safe for a long time. It's good. I don't want to scare the kid. Because of them. I know what those monsters out there are. Wendigo. Um, Grandma told me about them. It's not a win to go. It's what happens when someone eats another person. Oh? I hadn't heard that one before. Do they scare you too? They make lots of noise. Even at night. I'll tell you a secret. They scare me too sometimes. If you don't know what a win to go is, look it up. It's... It's, uh, it's interesting. I've been waiting for him. Where is he? But I can see why he why thinks that. Come get me. Where is my dad? I can't. Oh. He can't come right now. I want to wait here for my dad. Alex. I don't want to tell him his dad is dead. I can't do that. I want my dad. I want Greg back. I want everything to go back to the way it was. <laughs> Daddy. I wish it could go back too. I wish it all the time. We all sort of do. Greg, when he... Did he become one of them? It, it, it's what happens. Oh, uh... He did. I made sure he wouldn't stay that way. When someone dies... I hope he understands. Or something sharp, right here. What? And they're not a Wendigo anymore. Okay? Is that what's gonna happen to me? Am I gonna die and change into one too? <laughs> no. I'm going to protect you. Nothing out there will hurt you. Thanks. No problem, Alex. 
I just learned his name right now. <laughs> Thanks for letting me see your fortress. And the music continues. Alright, sorry to say guys, but that's all the time we have for today. Uh, please join me next time in the next episode of The Walking Dead and Thank you all. Uh, please subscribe, like, and favor this video. Goodbye!